Monkey 1000 and today I have a Timu haul. And yes, I'm by myself again. She's back in the hospital. She's really having a hard time. So um, they're doing some other tests finally, doing something different. Um, hopefully they get to the bottom of it very soon. So um, yeah, so we're going to get into this right now. Okay, guys, so I'm going to open this up. Uh, my other Timu stuff. And we'll go through this. I'm going to put it, the bag down here. And I'm just going to grab things. And we'll go from there. Okay, so my first one is... Ooh, ooh, where did my thing go? Okay. My first thing is, it's a sensor soap dispenser. Now, I had one before. And I got it from um, Goodwill over in Crystal River. And it stopped working because I put the not soap in it. I put hand sanitizer in it. And it said you could use it that way, but it just, I think it ruined it. So I decided to get me another one. And the box is not the best as usual. Um, yeah, it could be desired, um, you know. So this one says you can apply to ki all kinds of liquid soap for hand, face, hair, bath, dishwash, dishware, etc. Um, you need four um, AAA size batteries, which I have. I have to go over there and get them. And I'll do that in a few minutes. So, um, yeah. I paid $4.99 for this. Now, I can't remember what I paid at the one at Goodwill because it was brand new. Um, I don't remember how much I paid. So, this has an extra piece for the bottom, I guess. That's what it's for. It must be like for this down here. And there's your where your batteries go in there. And... Um, I got stainless steel because I have a lot of stainless steel stuff. I almost got the, I wanted it when we were looking at the oven, I really wanted to get a stainless steel one. Um, but we got the same one because of all the parts that we can use on the other one. So that's why we got a new oven. So, but maybe the next round I might get stainless steel. I mean, some people gripe about them because they got fingerprints all over them and stuff like that. And the fridge is still white, and I'm not going to do anything to the fridge until it goes, you know. I do have a backup in the garage, my other fridge, until I buy one. But, um, yeah, that, that fridge is getting old. It, it was my mom and dad's fridge that I have in here, and mine is in the garage. So um, we put drinks in that one and our fishing stuff. <laughs> So, anyways, for this, it's supposed to give you directions here. It does. It has a user manual. It's safety instructions, product overview, and um, uh, oh, it just it just operates battery removal and stuff like that. So I'll put, I'll put this here if you're interested. You guys can stop it and read it. If you really want to, I might have a little shadow there. Sorry. And there it is on the back. So if you're interested in one, you might. I mean, for the price for $4.99, I couldn't pass it up. You know, I guess this is where you put your soap in. If you guys can see that. And you just put whatever you want in there. I'm not sure what I want to use this for. I might use it for hand soap instead of my dish soap, but then I was like, oh, this would be cute for my dish soap. I don't know. I haven't decided yet. That Shaver's phone going off. It goes off like crazy because he got a new cell phone, and 
they gave him a number that all these people keep calling him phony people so you know solicitors unfortunately so anyways i think this might do it we'll see how well it works i'll put it at the end of the video um and we'll sh we'll, we'll test it out okay the next thing i got what was this oh this is a girl stuff so guys if you don't want to look you don't have to you can fast forward over this this is a bra now i'm a big girl i have to buy my bras and i spend money on my bras you know expensive so everybody's griping about their bras so i'm like you know i'm having trouble putting my bra on because of my frozen arm and my neck so i was like well let me see this one i have never ever in my whole life paid five dollars and 99 cents for a bra never and till now so if this works out i am saving me some money i mean i have paid over a hundred dollars for a bra yeah because i have to have a good one now i like this bra because it has the back has a little thing on the back like that and i liked it i don't really need the padding i can take it out which is good but if it's girls that need padding they can leave them in i don't need them <laughs> i got enough padding <laughs> so i'll just take those little doodads right out that's fine with me and then it has a a zipper so it zips up in the front which i thought might help me a lot better i have the ones that you put over your head and um you know and i wear them so um i stopped i used to wear i used to have to wear wire and i got to the point you know they hurt they got to be too too harsh so um it, and you end up taking them out anyways after a while because they poke holes in the sides of them. So I had the, it was enough for me. So I'm going to try this out. Hopefully it'll work. I really hope it does. It wasn't my size. I'm not telling you my size. That's personal. <laughs> but um, yeah. So um, they had them in all different sizes. They do have different colors. Um, we'll see how it works out. If it doesn't, then I'll have to maybe my mom might be well she can't wear mine huh that ain't gonna work that poor woman doesn't have any so um she needs a bra like this so she may like a bra like this because it should support because it goes up you know you go up and it has a band a nice band underneath i hope this works that would be amazing for me really would but i'm not modeling this so i'm sorry girls but nah. I'm too big for that if i was tiny maybe <laughs> so that was 5.99 so the next thing let me see um all right we'll do this one this was i got this for the toaster yeah i know people buy covers for them and they've been doing that forever but this is a cover for just the holes and I got it in black because my toast was black. I'm probably going to have to get a new toaster soon. I got it at um, Dollar General when my mom came here about almost four years now. My mom has been here. So I bought that at Dollar General because I didn't, I didn't use a toaster. I, I never ate bread. I like bread, but I'm always trying to be careful, you know, with bread. So I just figure well if i don't have a toaster i won't make toast i don't need it you know i'm by myself you know but my mother likes to have her toast so i bought her one and we got a dollar general for five bucks and this thing is still going shaver has had to fix it a couple of times but it's still going for five dollars it's done very well for four years so i'm gonna put this in the top of the toaster and i'll show you at the end of this video so you guys can see but this was how much i pay for this 224 and they did come in different colors so i got that 
Okay. I am looking for my other one here. All right. Now, I got these. Got some tulips. The reason why I got tulips is for this. My little feathers. I, I thought maybe I'd put these in there with them. There, you can see them better. I'm going to take them out. I paid... Um, this gives you eight pieces, it says. And I paid four thirty one for these. I like their artificial flowers. They're really nice. They're better than Dollar Tree. And, you know, you're not paying a fortune for them. I don't want to pay a fortune for fake flowers. But I tell you, these things look real. They feel real. I mean, this stem feels like a stem. That's amazing. Wow. Now, if they only made them smell, they would, they would, you wouldn't know. You wouldn't know. So, I'm going to put them in here. Maybe along the side or something of my feathers. And they're cute for Easter. So, you can arrange it whatever you want. I might just put it around in a circle. But, um, I didn't get that many. I didn't, you know, I wanted to see if I like these. I don't need any more, really. These are really cute, though. These are, I like them. Oh, it's so cute. They feel really nice. I wonder what they use for the material on these. Because they're not like Walmart. Or even, you know, anywhere, you know? I mean, if you go to Michael's and them, I wouldn't... Uh, no, I don't even go there. I don't bother. Their stuff is too expensive for my taste. Uh-uh. I mean, if I was really into artsy stuff and and that, maybe I would go there and, and spend money. But first of all, the only closest Michael's there is is in Ocala. And that's about an hour and a half away, so I'm not going there. So I would just put it around, and there we go. They're so cute. I just kind of blend them in a little bit. I'll play with it later. And it's cute. I like these. And I can always take these and put them in my basket up at, up there. On the wall there. But I thought that would look cute for a decoration on the table there. So you can see them. There you go. Yeah. And I love my tablecloth and that. They're so cute. Okay, so let me see here. Um, yeah, for 431 for eight, that's, they're great. I like them. Pretty. All right, I have one more in here. I'm going to save the last. Okay, I'll save I saw, who did I see get this? Oh, I can't remember. Um, I think it was Kitty, Kitty Street. Anybody ever watched her? I watched her, and she has her mom on there too sometimes. And they're also doing restaurant stuff now. I believe that's where I found this, was on there. And I was like, you know what? I'm going to upgrade and get me a new one for the bathroom. This is a garbage can. It's an economical garbage can. I paid $12.10 for it. Now, I've had the other garbage can. I bought it when I moved in here, so it's been seven years since I had that one. So, it's time for a new one. And this one's a little bit nicer. You know, I just had a regular cheap garbage can in there. You know, that and the problem with that, it overflows and... You know, it gets stuff everywhere. And Bruno likes to eat the um, Q-tips. So if I clean my ears from the water, from the washing my hair and stuff, and they get in the garbage can and he knows it, he will try to eat them. So this way, he won't be able to do that no more. Because it has a lid on it. So this is cute. I got it in white. 
for the bathroom. And it gives, this is just a qualified certificate I found in there. Uh, cute. Funny. So, and then here's the lid. I'll bring it up a little bit here so you guys can see a little bit better. And here's the lid. And I thought this would be great. And if I really like it, I might get one for our bedroom instead of what we have in there. This is battery operated. I will put the batteries in it and show you. I don't know. I think these are probably double A's. I'll, I'll have to play with it and find out because it's not really saying. They don't give you directions for the thing. So, yeah, see, it opens up like that. See? So I'll put some batteries in it and I'll show you in just a minute. I'll have to put this on here. Yep, there you go. And then you'll push the button and it will bring this lid up and i'll bring it up and then it closes it on its own too so it'll close so Bruno won't be able to get in this it's a little bit bigger than my other one so i think this will be great you know make the bathroom look nicer i think the bathroom will be happier with a new garbage can <laughs> so i'm going to go get the batteries for this stuff and um we'll check them out i'll be right back okay guys so i got the batteries in it you need two triple two double a's that's what you need so i went to dollar tree today and i got a bunch of batteries we needed them and i knew that i needed some batteries for this video today so um i need to get them so here you go oops well, maybe I just did it on its own. Hmm. There it goes. Maybe I'm pushing it too fast. And it opens, and then it will close. It closed on its own, I think. And just wait a second, and it should close. There it goes on its own. Cute. I really like it. I hopefully this will work out. I'll just have to, you know, wait a few minutes. It's a little slow. I don't know. Maybe my, these batteries are brand new. So there it goes. And then you close it. Yeah. We'll see. There it goes. <laughs> it's cute. Anyways. I like it. I think that way Bruno won't get in my garbage. That's the only thing he takes out of it. So, um, yeah. So, that one I really, really like. Yes. Thumbs up for me. Okay, guys. There's the lid. It's a little bit bigger than I thought it would be for the toaster, but I need to get a new toaster anyways um yeah so but it'll keep it covered make it a little bit nicer i thought i thought maybe i had it backwards but i don't but that's the way it goes so it's a little bit tad see the toaster's a little bit small for this but <clears throat> i gave me a new toaster and they probably fit just fine but that'll be fine for now i'm fine with it for the moment and i'll get a new toaster Okay, guys, so I put the batteries in it. You need double A's for that, and you need four of them. So I put them in there. Oh, no. See, it works. <laughs> I got it on my table. Okay, stop. Stop. All right, I got it on my table. There you go. It works just fine. I think I'm going to like this one much better. It is a little smaller than the other one, but that's fine. Let me clean up my mess. Okay, guys, so I used one of these. I got these at Dollar Tree, and it filled that whole thing up. So just to let you know that, how many ounces is this? 7.5 fluid ounces. So 
that's all you you need to put in that um that's it that's all i have for now shaver in the back or having his smoke break there so that's it um yeah i have another one coming Timu. yeah timu yeah but it really won't be here until the beginning of april so yeah so we'll we'll get that one going when it comes up and that is all i got for now guys so monkey says she's out y'all have a great weekend and i'll see you in the next one bye y'all Thank you.